Hey everybody, I'm going to make a short little video about how to hold the French bass bow, which is what all of my students are using. And before I start, just a disclaimer that this is how I hold the bow, and this is how I was taught to hold the bow. I've had several different teachers growing up. I started bass when I was eight. There's my bass. And um, it, every teacher had something that was just slightly different, and so I kind of picked and I decided what was best for me because of, you know, the size of my hand. I have I have shorter fingers, and so I'm sure my bow hold is different than my teacher's, and, and so this is just what I do. So you're going to go and surf YouTube, and you're going to see that everybody is going to be saying something a little bit different, but I think we all have the same principles down, and so... Hopefully that is something that is going to go through these videos that you'll see. And the first one is that you don't want tension in your hand. And that's a big problem with younger players because you think of it as a bow grip. And so you're going to see some crazy things. You're going to see fingers coming down too far. You're going to see people squeezing it. And uh, those are the things you want to watch out for. So let's talk about how to get started. First thing you want to think of is, again, no tension. So I like to start with just thinking of my fingers relaxed like this. Some people start this way with their thumb kind of tucked in like that, and it's very relaxed. There's no tension in my fingers, everything's relaxed. So I'm gonna start this way. I'm gonna take my bass bow, there it is. Now this is how I hold it. I like my middle finger right here on the metal, and everything else is just relaxed. I spread them out. My thumb is going right here, nice gentle curve to my thumb and then I spread them out. I have a nice short little like thick grip on my bow which is perfect for my finger and where it lands so that's that's really awesome. Um, you don't want your pinky up top that's a violin bow hold. Bring it down. Sometimes people stick their pinkies out or they do crazy things. Nope, bring them in. That's gonna cause tension and don't let your wrist drop below Keep your wrist up, nice gentle slope. And that's, re that's really it for the base bow hold. Um, of course, things will change when you put the bow onto the strings, but this is just, you know, just to get you started. This is your bow hold. And hopefully you can see everything. And if you have any comments or questions, uh, feel free to post, you know, a comment under this video. And again, this is just my bow hold. This is how I teach. Feel free to use other bow holds. Thanks.